um, an issue which I raised, I raised and I didn't um, get any comment is the, the intention of the state party to with regard to instituting independent investigations on the findings of the Ryan report. Because what I, I, I my question was within the context of the Articles 12 and 13, because as, I, as you know very well that um, the obligation imposed upon the party is that it has a duty, ex officio, without any complaint made, to institute independent investigation into any, whenever there is reasonable suspicion that uh, uh, ill treatment or torture might have been committed. And I think there is information, otherwise we wouldn't have the findings of the commission, but unfortunately this information is uh, confidential. And uh, also I ask whether what is the intention of the, of the state party to provide compensation within the context of 14 to the victims of these violations. Also, um, let me again repeat the position of uh, my position, and uh, I, th I think it's the position of this committee, about uh, the intention of the state party to, to investigate allegations of ill treatment by the, um, Magdal uh, by the women who were incarcerated in the laundry. Uh, and uh, that again, it's within the context of Articles 12, 13, in the sense that you you said it yourself that uh, even your definition of torture um, uh, contains the element of omission. And this is, uh, again, one of those cases that the, um, the, the, the state party might have failed to exercise due diligence, diligence to these people. And uh, in view of the, of the evidence that we have, and it is provided with names, I think it is the responsibility, again, that the state party should investigate and that also to find ways to ensure that these women do obtain redress within the context of Article 14. Now, with regard to...